The Adam and Wax Show. Let's get right into it. As long as Snoopy's doing his goddamn Instagram Listen, story. All right, no, no, I'm not putting that in that This is crazy. We're you actually bringing it? together the two slimiest slimes <laughs> on the West Coast. <laughs> they thought it was impossible. I thought it was impossible. Good for the culture. Wack you know went and got a chain. Oh, no, I've been at this chain. To just stunt during the interview. This is good for the culture. It is. West Coast. We own. Sometimes you got to do. You know. They not uh, like us. They you not always, like us. You always they wanted us. to do it. You mentioned it several times. So you said this is one of your a guests that you like to interview. I like him. I but think like, he's a good guy. Like, I think he's he's misrepresented by the people sometimes that they give him a hard time about a bunch of shenanigans. I, see, I like the guy. Well, listen. What well, you supposed to? You're a white dude. And the people, <laughs> right? The people, they got their reasons mm -hmm. for, um, you know, having their opinions about them. Right? And I've talked to him ex extensively. We didn't went over the whole checklist. Yeah. How many hours of phone calls had to take place between you guys? About two, three. Like, like three two-hour phone calls. And this is not Clubhouse. This is really just yeah. FaceTime audio. You guys I'm getting it out. in. On the, because what happens is, is he's telling me things that people told him. I don't even know the people. Like, he swore I paid his homies to, to do something to him. That's how they made it look. I don't even know them. I know one Hollywood. Mm-hmm. So it just so happened when I left here one day, went to the Tronics house, the one Hollywood I know is there. Okay. I FaceTime him. Mm -hmm. I said, yo, tell him what you just told me. He like, nah, that never happened. Facts. Wack don't even know them. So, but if mom know that two entities don't talk, they can run whatever narrative but they want. But why would they want to convince you that Wack was trying to get know, you hurt? Because, yeah. because they, wanted, they wanted to make it look like... They, they know my dream is to be an artist, be a rapper. You know what I'm saying? So they wanted to hinder that and wanted to make it feel like that they was beating me somehow. Like, yeah, Wack don't even f with you, but he f with us, though. You get what I'm saying? So it was mm. one but of those But this is the thing with that. Me. And I think the youth now, when it comes to f with, I'm so into helping people. He called, I don't know how he got my phone number. Internet what? Mm. He called me as a total stranger. So yeah. this goes back to the tight pants conversation. No, this is that was like the third yeah, conversation. Yeah, 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 yeah the third conversation. That was uh, that. He called me as a total stranger and told me I just Snoopy badass, this where I'm from. Right? I said, okay, what can I do for you? So I'm a rapper. I'm just trying to get some points. I've been rapping for like a year, six months, whatever it mm -hmm. was. And uh, you know, I asked him for his socials. Right? I could have hung the phone up, I'm busy. Right. I take the time out of my day when I get these calls, right? To to help people. So he gave me a social, I'm looking at him, he's like, well, what do you think? And listen to a few of my songs. I said, off the top, your look gotta change. It's not us that's controlling the purchase, the uh, buying music, it's, we streaming now. And the kids aren't gonna understand the khaki suit and jerry curl, right? And I use game, for example, game six, five. Right. Right? He finds a way to wear something trendy that fits him, where he's not looking like a skinny jean skateboard guy but he still got his swag up to a point to where the fans his fan base would do you think that you took that advice the wrong way um yeah i did i, I feel like i took it the wrong way you know what i'm saying you feel me because you know i he I'm, was on I'm, his I'm, gangster I'm, gangster I'm, yeah i'm on some <laughs> i'm on some gangster shit so you gotta and understand I'm you a nigga, know that a nigga, a, a nigga coming at me talking about yeah tighten up your pants boo -boo, but I knew he wasn't tripping because one day when I was chilling with Slim 400, he was going. He was taking me to this red carpet treatment. I mean, this red carpet uh, situation. And Slim 400 was like, "Man, you should put on some um, some some tighter jeans." So, and that was like right after me and you talk. So, I was like, "Man, is that the swag?" But you know, you see me swagging. No, that's what I'm swagging saying. right now. Yeah. You feel me? I'm swagging no, now. What's though. crazy is everything I was telling him. I did. He did. I ended up doing it because, mm. but I didn't understand it. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, I'm coming straight in. Off some gangster shit, you know what I'm saying? I got a Jerry curl and khakis, niggas fresh from the hood, gang banging. You feel me? So I kind of miss it. So I'm like, that. I miss that look. Yeah, you know, but it, nigga do it sometimes. Uh, you guys still be able to bust it out, right? Of course. I mean, okay. listen. Um, if the day comes, hopefully it will, that he gets his spark and gets his in, and and creates his fan base and gives him a couple. Why are you dissing him? Create his fan base? He already has a fan base. <laughs> no, he still got to build his fan base. <laughs> okay, we all need to build our I, yeah, fan base, got, but he no, has no, no, an no, existing listen, fan base as listen, well. Yeah. Listen, this is real shit. It's levels to this shit, right. right? I can say Blueface has a fan base 
But then Kendrick Lamar has a different fan base. Right. Right? So, yeah, his fan base is stronger than some, but it's some that's stronger than his. But he's not in a position to where he can just do what the f*** he want and they're going to follow it. Right. When you get to that point, then Drake right now, if he went on tour and put on khakis and a Jerry Crow, nigga, they're going to go crazy. Yeah, you, yeah, basically saying you got you got to write, write, write what's going on for me to make them accept you for that. Then they're going to accept you just for who you is. Whatever you, know you want to do. That's yeah, just the way it that. works. It's right? called being an iconoclast. You come in the game. Hey, you listen, don't change man. who you are. If you're Nav, you just keep but, saying but, but you that know, N-word. But you know what? Though? I, I, I understand. Nick going Nick gonna to switch it up. You feel Nav me? Nav, stop saying and, that. And, and, come, and come with the newer swag. But you know, every now and then, you know, Snoopy going to come with the Jerry Curl khakis and stuff, though. But I understand what Wax saying, though. Yeah, that's you know, all. But, but what's crazy is... Look at the short end of the stick I get. You always tell this story because you just love that one time in your life you were able to be the stylist. No, no. <laughs> I talked about everything, right? I talked about everything. But look, I didn't ask for the phone call. Right. Mm-hmm. I get pulled into some shit, right? Trying to be helpful. Now, if I'd have watched this, if I'd have been like, who? This still be badass with Holly or Paul Rue. Nigga, I don't know you click. Then it would have been a song I'll call F- Whack 100. Uh, I don't think I would have. Oh, you would have used that. that. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you would have hung up on me, I would have, yeah, that nigga, you know what I'm saying, hung up on so me. So damn yeah, if but, I do, damn you know, if I don't. <laughs> right. <laughs> right? It's real shit. I'm like, Adam, it's real shit. I'm the f- power feature of podcast or clickbait. You put my name in some shit, say you could be a nobody. Little Sleazy said, he wants to fight whack. Everybody. That's true me. about all of us. There's like a million people yeah. making videos about yeah. me, everything no, 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 I no, do. No, no, There's I, people making it. videos about everything he does. Cap. You just see it all about yourself because no, you only pay attention to yourself. No, I don't pay attention to <laughs> none of it. But Adam, your name, when it comes to that algorithm right. of clickbait, it's gold. It's not with whack 100 names to me. I don't know, man. Nobody's using your name. Man, they, they do tear, they, all they the tear time. They don't up. use your name. I feel like you're kind of delusional. They don't. Okay, people regularly make videos about me where the title is like The Rise and Fall of Adam-22 or The Morbid History of Adam-22 or whatever of and get over a million views. No, of course. I'm, with I'm just that. saying that, oh, that says come, something listen, no, that's about great. the level of interest in my demise. Great. Mm-hmm. I when understand. It, when it comes to a nobody mother that wants a look, oh, yeah, they, I'm, WAC 100 is the go-to name. Yeah, of course. I, I go through that, too. We, we all go say something about why. Yeah, they be on your ass. Though. I'm just saying that you're not. <laughs> you're unique. I don't even know these motherfuckers. Yes, people make videos about you, but they make videos about me and a lot of people as well. 